face in your face. Good afternoon, Michigan. Coming back at you with another G Brothers review. I'm Nico, little bro, and that's Steph. Big bro. And we are on our hunt, our quest, our mission to find the best tacos. Oh, oh you dropped something? That's okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Good, good, good. Uh, to find the best tacos and tortilla. What are they called? Quesadillas. Quesadillas. Quesadillas, stupid. Okay. We are in, uh, what is this world? Look? No, Troy. We are in Troy, Michigan. Troy, Michigan. We are at a new place. Brand new place opened up. I think it's been two weeks. They're called El Locos Quesadilla. Quesadilla. El, El Locos Loco Quesadilla. Stupid. Quesadilla, Quesadilla. We, you guys pick what you want to say. I say Quesadilla. Um, and real quick, shout out to Sarah Carlone. Sarah Carlone recommended this place. She said, go try it. You got to try the tacos and their quesadillas. And I said, well, we're going to do it because you said they're really, really good. I talked to a lady in there. She was really nice. It was a lady. Like I said, it was really, really nice. Beautiful. But well, now we're going to do it. So I got the um, fish tacos and the chicken fajita. Big bro got, you want to show yours to the camera? No, I don't. So you, you no, you don't. Just show it to the camera so they can see what it is. Like, no, you don't. Okay, pop it. Pop top on it. We don't need to do that. All right. I got a... You got... What did you get? She, he got a steak, a Philly steak quesadilla, right? Hold on. Let me put the camera down to it. Oh, that's my hand. Ooh, nice. Looks really nice. Is that seasoning on top? What is that? Yeah. Actually, that kind of looks really nice. All right, I don't know what this first one is. Oh, this is the chicken. Yeah or no? This is the chicken, fajita, the chicken fajita taco, as you guys can see on here. Lettuce, tomato, lettuce, tomato, chicken, fajita style. This smells so fun. It's so good. I'm sorry, I'm not cussing. This smells really good. All right, we'll crack into it. Mmm. Mm. That is hot spice. I like that. Oh, this is really good, actually. Mmm. You like it? It's like seasoning on the top of it. Mm -mm. No, it's not. It's spice. That's what I mean, like seasoning, spice seasoning. This is really good. Yeah. What is that? Okay, that's the grilled peppers that's giving me that really, really nice feeling. Cool. I like these a lot. Not hot. Chicken fajita taco. Yours is hot, huh? Mm. Their chicken tastes really fresh, bro. Again, they just opened up. Um, please visit them. Let them know that G Brother sent you, but and Sarah Carlone sent you. Actually, let them know Sarah Carlone sent you. Um, their chicken is so like well grilled and fresh. Lady told me the chef and the lady at the counter own the place. Oh, I forgot what her name was, so I'm sorry, but shout out to that lady. She was very polite and nice. He's a master chef. Yeah, this is good. I can't compare it to other... But the guy's a master chef, which I think is actually pretty dope, to be honest with you. Take your time, because I'm going to have to rate two different things, so you can take your time. I like this kind of steak cheese. I would have liked um, some sauce on here, but it's really fresh tasting. The grilled vegetables are so fucking. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you so, want me to cut you a piece? No, you're good. You're good. I gotta. I have another taco left to eat. Well, this is really this good. This comes with peppers, salted peppers, chicken fajita, and lettuce. That's what this comes with. And for this one, they're chicken Mine fajita. Comes with uh, onions. Oh my god, that peppers, looks... provolone cheese, melted everywhere, and it's spicy too. On the, um... I didn't know that. Yours looks really, really good. Yeah, like it's really, really good. Really, really, really good. All right, bye. Yeah, it's for the chicken fajita taco. Got a little carbage here, but not a big deal. I'm going to give them, for the chicken fajita taco, 
El Locos Quesadillas. I'm gonna give them a, that was really good. Again, they're, they're really, really good. Master Chef in there. I'm gonna give it a 7.8. Like their, their chicken fajita tacos are really good. Like it's a really good taco. Like seriously, legit. Now this one's loaded. This one's loaded all over the place. This comes with uh, slaw and uh, the Probably salsa is, just this. is a corn salsa. Well, you want me to just cut your piece? I mean, bro, I'm going to have to get three different scores then today. I don't, okay. Like, you're going to be shopping my score. Oh my God. I love fish tacos. This is their fish taco. Look at that slaw. Oh, Look at that slaw on there. Yeah, Big bro doesn't like slaw. I do fresh red. Oh, I love it when people use red onions, bro. I love it when people use red onions. And it's the, uh, the salsa is a corn salsa. Lettuce on here. That, oh I wonder what the spices they put on here. Mm. This is gonna be this is gonna be a banger in the street. The fish taco is gonna be a banger in the streets. I can already tell. You can already tell it's a banger in the streets. The streets of Troy. I'm ready to give my score, bro. You're gonna be shocked with my score. I'm a little biased because I really like fish tacos. So fish tacos aren't ever going to get a high score. From, just like with gyros. I'm really biased. I really like them. I like the slaw in here. It's good. I don't know. It doesn't mix that well to me with the fish, but it's still good tasting slaw. If you have your score, go. Because I just gave my score. So if you have your score, go. Because I'm going to score this right here. Oh, but hold on. Okay. Score real quick. Score this? Yeah, because i got to explain. Go ahead and explain why I'm, I'm eating this. Uh, Fuck beast, bro. The, the fish is really good. I don't know if this is cod, right? Sure. A catfish, but it tastes like cod. Um, you know, I like steak and cheese. Cheese steaks. This is different in a way, but it's really good. I mean, really good. Especially the idea with the spice they put on it. That's really smart. I never had one with spice on it. So I'm going to give them... Um, this is not going to sound crazy. I would give them for their cheese steaks that they have here. I would give them... It's a quesadilla. Quesadilla. Quesadilla cheese steaks? Yeah. Uh, I'm going to give them like um, eight one eight two. You got to go... What's the score? Fuck, this is really good, bro. You can't go 8182. What's the actual score? I'm going to give them an eight one. All right, so this, is, this is gold standard. For this a is a really gold good... Standard. I don't really eat Mexican food. You know that. I yeah. like burritos and that's it. Uh, this is really good. This is really, really, really good. Um, okay, so for their fish taco with the slaw and everything, uh, fish is really good. I like the fish a lot. It tastes really good. Um, but that slaw, even though I really like that slaw, it doesn't go good with the fish taco. It just doesn't. You know what doesn't go good with it? What? Fish. What do you mean? Fish is amazing. Disgusting. I only eat one kind of fish. Mm. Fish is good. Um, I'm not getting any more of that. The chicken fajitas were amazing. That's definitely the one I would recommend. They do have Asian shrimp tacos, veggie tacos, and beef and um beef and bean tacos. I didn't try those other ones. I got two things that look the best on that menu. Because when I did ask the lady, she said everything's good, so I can't tell you. I can't suggest. So I got what I thought would be the best, which is fish tacos. And um, uh, chicken fajita tacos. For their fish tacos, it's not going to get a high score in my book. Uh, the, the the chicken fajita got a seven eight, and that's that's a really good score. This is a must visit here if you want any kind of chicken tacos. For me personally, it's a must visit. Steph is saying their quesadillas is gold standard stamped. That's how good they are. Which I believe it the way I looked at it when I looked at yours, bro. Not only was it juicy cheese running. The steak looked good. Fish tacos, guys, I'm giving a six. Point. So it's a neighborhood spot. If I'm in the neighborhood, I'll probably get fish tacos from them. I might say, you know, go really light on that slaw and that corn salsa. I might say forget go light the, on that. Forget the tacos. Get this uh, cheesesteak. Yeah. This is so different. I like cheesesteaks. This is a different kind of cheesesteak, and it's good. It's yeah, it's because really it looks like a quesadilla cheese. It's a, uh, what is that? Uh, not Tex-Mex? Is that what that's called? I don't know, bro. But I would definitely come here and get a cheesesteak again. Um, not just if I'm in the air. I mean, I would drive out here to get a cheesesteak. It's, it's so not different. a cheesesteak, though. I know. It's a quesadilla cheesesteak, but it's, yeah. it's so different, it's good. But yeah. I really like it. 
uh, closing, what I'm gonna say is, if you want, try the other tacos they have. It's a master yeah. chef here, that's what I was told. Their chicken fajita taco, A1. It's a must visit if you're in the area. Their quesadillas is a gold Dia, bro. quesadilla. Dia, Dia. There's no E, man. There's no <coughs> is a gold, I know, is a gold stamp. That means like they, they're up there, right? They're not only a must visit, they're gold, right? Um, when it comes to the fish tacos, I said, what did I say, six, four, six, six five? five? Yeah, they're a good neighborhood spot for fish tacos, but it's not, uh, I'm not going to say it's up there in fish tacos. Their fish tacos are not, they're not a must visit and they're not a gold standard at all. But they're good still if it was in the neighborhood. I, I would eat them, but it's, it wouldn't be the, the, the first thing I'd pick on their menu, to be honest with you. Anyways, new place, El Locos, Quesadillas, come visit them in Troy. Oh. Let them know Sarah Colon sent you. And do you have anything to say before I uh, sh uh, do the closing? Yeah. Um, I'm going to hurt you so bad as soon as we turn this video off. If you guys only knew what I'd do to him. I guess you get like some Mexican music playing in the intro. And I got a text message. Anyways, um, so remember the three most important things in life, guys. That's your faith, family, and food. And until next time, you guys stay dangerous. Don't the Super Bowl was awesome. Matthew yeah. Stafford got one. All the haters out there. Listen, I'm not a fan of the Los Angeles Rams. I like Stafford when he plays here. I'm still a fan of the Lions. But there's some guys when they go out, I like to see them be successful. You know what yeah, I mean? Like, he was loyal to this bum-ass team loyal. for 12 years. The so, Lions suck. I wish you would have won it with us, but it was impossible. The Lions organization sucks, so it never would have happened. But anyways, please come visit the place, guys. Again, one more time. El Locos Quesadillas. I say quesadillas, but it's quesadillas. Because he's retarded. That's right. <laughs> Anyways, and I'll uh, stay safe out there. We'll see you guys next time.